Right now we will quickly go through all display settings on Redmi A5, so let's get started. Let's go into the settings and right here we can find these display settings. As we go in there, the first option is the brightness level. Simply as you tap on the option, right here there is the slider appearing and with this one you can change the brightness of your screen. Also you can do the same thing in this quick settings right here. Next, right there we can find the adaptive brightness with this option. As you turn it on, this uses the front camera to measure ambient lightning and adjust screen brightness when device wakes up. So, as you can see, as you turn this option on, the screen will automatically just adjust its brightness depending on the environment. Next, there we have the outdoor mode option, which will adjust screen brightness to ambient lightning for outdoor viewing. Basically, when you're outside and the sunlight falls on your screen, on your phone, it is hard to see anything. So this option makes your screen even brighter to uh, to actually see anything, to make the screen visible when outside. Next we have some lock screen uh, settings right here and there are some privacy settings. We can add a text on the lock screen, show QRs, code scanner and there are some other different options as you can see. You can enable this option to lift to check phone which basically is rise to wake and here you can also name toggle the wake screen for notifications options. So yeah, these are these lock screen uh, options in the display. Uh, next we have the screen timeout, which basically you can change the time uh, for your screen to be waked up. And after this 30 seconds, for example, the screen will go off. So yeah, simple as that. Let me just change this real quick for right here. All right. Next we have the dark theme. So all you simply have to do is just press this dark theme if you want to toggle it on or off and yeah you can change it right here you can also probably change this dark theme in the squeak settings i believe somewhere here you might be able to find the this button yeah right here there is this button to change the dark theme to toggle it and also as you go for more options for this dark theme you can toggle the schedule um, for the dark theme to uh, toggle uh, you can toggle to turn on uh, at the custom time or turn on from sunset to sunrise and you can also disable this schedule for the dark theme. Next, we have the display size and text. So simply, you can adjust the size of your font, of your uh, text overall. As you change it and you want to apply these changes, actually, you'll have to go back from these uh, settings, from this display size and text settings. And this will apply the changes. As you can see, the same thing applies to the display size, to the bold text, actually it changes immediately. And also there is high contrast text available right here. Let me just quickly set up the settings. All right. So yeah, these are all of these settings right here for the display and size. Uh, and also these are the last settings. Night light, which basically is the um, uh, warm light, the uh, blue light filter. Oh yes, the blue light filter. So here you can set up the intensity of this blue light filter. You can also set up the schedule. The same as for the dark mode filter, uh, the dark mode actually, and you can also toggle this blue light filter in the quick settings right here. This moon icon is this blue light filter. And yeah, next what we have is the colors and contrast, which is the color scheme basically. As you can see, there is this uh, the color palette, and you can change the tint on the screen as you can see. And also, there are some free options. To set up the standard uh, color, warm color, and cool color. Also, there is this option to automatically to automatic contrast, but you cannot actually do anything with it. And yeah, that's all for this color and contrast. Next, there is a color contrast, which is not the same as this one right here. Basically, there are three options, and as you can see, you have the preview of how it looks like. It changes the contrast of displayed uh, items, various items right here. And additionally, you can turn on the high contrast text right here. And yes, so let's go back to default. And right here, we also have the auto rotate screen option. We can toggle the auto rotation, toggle it on or off. And the refresh rate, which is the last option right here. We can change the refresh rate for 260 Hertz or to 120 Hertz. The 120 Hertz is uh, simply more Mm, smooth is actually better, but it's faster 
uh, draining for the battery so if you want to save your battery you will go for the 60 hertz so yeah as you can see these are all of these display options on the redmi a5